Hey guys, what's going on? This is Mike and today I'm doing a what's in my travel bag or tech bag sort of video. I did this uh, a couple months back where I traveled to San Francisco. I made the video actually in the airport. Uh, but I have some new technology in my bag this year and uh, I figured I'm going on vacation. Uh, this time I'm going to Europe so it's going to be pretty cool. And I figured I'd show you what I'm going to keep in my bag uh, when I'm traveling. So we can start from left to right and work our way down. So I uh, first have a Spigen battery pack. I think this is called the Spigen Volt Pack for the iPhone 6S. I do have a review of it on this channel. It's quite an old video. Uh, but yeah, feel free to go check it out. I'm also trying a new uh, cable management system this time. Instead of just throwing all the cables I need in the bag, I'm actually labeling my bag. So micro USB and then Apple cables. Uh, this is the same backpack that I had uh, in my other video when I traveled to San Francisco. I think I picked this up in a department store for around 50 bucks. It was a really good deal. It's a really good backpack. I'll try to link it below if I can find the brand and the model, uh, but it's a really good backpack. Uh, these are the Beats Solo 2 wireless headphones in red. I really like these headphones. I think they're going to be useful when uh, the next couple of iPhones don't have a headphone jack because uh, they're wireless. And I really like them because they're compatible with my iPhone. Uh, when I have my iPhone in a waterproof case because uh, it's not that easy to get headphones in when you have uh, a waterproof case on your phone. Uh, moving on here, this is my uh, 2015, early 2015 MacBook Pro 13.3 inch. I uh, installed uh, Mac OS Sierra on it, so uh, it has Siri on it. The beta is actually pretty stable. I was actually uh, pretty surprised by how stable the beta is. And even if I wanted to get off it, it's pretty hard to downgrade on a Mac. So, uh, yeah, Mac OS Sierra is uh, pretty good for the most part. Uh, just my um, charging cable for my Mac. Uh, I have a Seagate external hard drive. This is a terabyte, and uh, it's not even close to being filled. I think I have like 100 gigabytes on there. Not even close to being filled up. A uh, second pair of really good headphones. These are the Bose QC15s. They're super good on the plane because they cancel out all the noise. If you don't have a pair of noise canceling headphones for air, for airplanes, you should definitely pick up a pair. Uh, they, they changed my life on airplanes. Uh, moving up here, I don't think it's interesting to show cash, but uh, I'm going to Europe, so I did pick up some euros from the bank. I, could, I converted it from uh, Canadian dollars to euros. And uh, I have my Apple Watch charger. It's not wrapped up and put in the bag because I still have to charge my Apple Watch overnight before I head to the airport. Uh, just a wallet, my smart cover for my iPad Air 2. Uh, some bands here for my Apple Watch. This is a genuine Apple uh, navy blue sport band. And this is a knockoff Milanese loop I got on Amazon for about 30 bucks. Uh, this is a life proof free for the iPhone 6S. So when I was talking about the wireless headphones, uh, the lifeproof case is uh, the lifeproof case and the headphones go really well together because you don't have to plug in any cable with the wireless headphones. Uh, so it's pretty good and it protects your phone in water, dirt, snow, pretty much everything. Uh, the two cases that I decided to bring with me on the trip, uh, this is the Spigen Tough Armor and this is the Spigen Thin Fit. So. Two different types of cases for different scenarios. I have a backup iPhone, the iPhone 5. I went on Craigslist and I picked up a clunker phone because after what happened in uh, my winter trip to San Francisco, I destroyed my iPhone success by getting in a hot tub with it and I had to go buy a completely new one. So I figured if something bad happens to my iPhone again, I at least have a phone I can just throw my SIM card in and use. And last but not least, uh, certainly not least, this thing has saved me many times. This is the Jackery uh, 12,000 milliamp hour portable battery pack. Uh, I can charge my phone five or six times and uh, it's really good to just throw in a bag and use to charge your phone when you don't have power near you. Uh, anyways guys, that is what I keep in my travel bag. Hopefully you enjoyed this updated video. I don't know if all videos coming out over the summer when I'm on my trip, I'll definitely try. But uh, anyways, if you enjoyed this video, please drop a like down below. My name is Mike, and I'll see you in the next one.